Hey everybody, today I'm going to go through and help you try to understand how Ethereum mining rewards work. With a normal coin, you have a block time, that's how often a block is created. When blocks are created, that's when the mining rewards are issued out. So for Firo, the block time is about 6 minutes, and the reward for miners is 6.25. So every 6 minutes, 6.25 is issued to miners as a reward. But with Ethereum, you have a block time of 13 seconds. And within that block time, two per block are issued to miners. And then on top of that, the miners earn the gas fees. And normally, average gas price is around 40 to 70. 70 on a good day and 40 on a normal day. So that brings you to like three ether per block is being rewarded to the miners. But the last couple months, and especially this last weekend, the average gas price has been way up. And so what that means is there's more people trying to do transactions on the network. When it gets busy, average gas price goes up and the miners earn that reward. So you're looking at great earnings. So like here, we've got six 3060 TIs. A six card rig is earning 76 bucks mining Ethereum. Now, if you come down to like Firo, it's only 37 bucks. But ETH is killing it this weekend and it's like double the profits of normal. So that's how it's calculated, gas price. Keep an eye on that. I check this page every morning or so and kind of let me know what it's going to be, what kind of day it's going to be for mining. If it's above 100, it's going to be a good day. When it's sitting up in the 300s, it's going to be a great day. Uh, I've seen this go up to 500. I've seen it to where the block reward was 10 ETH before. So that's whoever finds that block is earning a lot of money. So that's the idea of how earnings are going up and down for Ethereum for mining. So when you see that your earnings are going down, not only do you have to look at difficulty that's been gradually rising up and up and up, it is, we're at seven, half that we were December. So since December, difficulty has doubled. So if you were mining in December and earning one ETH a day, today you're only earning a half a day. And then you add on top of those gas fees, then it could bring you back to that one a day. But that's not normal. This is not normal gas prices. It's crazy. It's great for earnings, but it's not normal. Uh, so once we get to July, the EIP 1559 that is going to burn those gas fees. So all this extra that's going to the miners is going to just be burnt at the source. So people are still going to be paying it, but the miners are not going to be getting it. So we'll be back down to just a plain old two ether are issued to miners every 13 seconds. So that's the idea. More people that are on the network drives down your earnings, but then the gas price moves it back up. And when it's expensive to move Ethereum, great for earnings on your mining. So that's, it's a, it's a give and take. Yeah, it sucks to have to pay a bunch and moving your ETH around, but it's good for you as a miner. So however you want to look at it, hopefully that gets you guys to understand how Ethereum earnings works. And I'll see you on the next one, guys. Later.